This is a fan-based learning uh, classic chem balancer website where we're going to go to practice uh, balancing chemical equations using the reaction in the video, uh, sodium in water, how exothermic it was, and then uh, you saw how we balance it uh, as a chemical equations. This will give you more practice. The object of the balancing, the objective in balancing chemical equations is that you have to have the same number of atoms on both sides of the equation. On the reactant side here we have iron and sulfur and then yields, remember that's the arrow, yields uh, on the right side of the arrow you have the products so you need to have the same number of them. So it's going to give you a drop down menu and you're going to write how many of each you need. So I'm going to click a 1 for 1 iron, uh, 1 for 1 sulfur and 1 for iron sulfide and we're going to click balance and it says correct uh, it tells you also that lat the iron comes, SE come from Latin ferrum which means iron and the ferrier which was a blacksmith who put iron shoes uh, on horses we're going to do uh, hydrogen plus chlorine gas to form hydrogen chloride that acid so here we have two hydrogens, but only on the reactant side we have two hydrogens, but we only have one hydrogen in the hydrogen, uh, hydrochloric acid on the product side. So we're going to use a two here. And we have two chlorines, and we have two chlorines on the product side in hydro, uh, hydrochloric acid. So we're going to use a uh, coefficient one for chlorine gas and a coefficient one for hydrogen gas and we're going to click balance and see how we do correct hydrochloric acid the stomach acid that breaks down the food you eat and i give you a little bit more information on it we're going to be working on this and this next one you're going to be doing on your own when you work uh, at your lab stations